Hey everybody, it's I Want To Be Retro. Today we're going to take a look at installing a Manjaro Linux VM in Proxmox. To get started, navigate to manjaro.org and download the latest installation ISO. With the installation ISO in hand, navigate to the Proxmox web UI and get logged in. Expand the Proxmox node name, then select the target storage device where we're going to upload the ISO. Select ISO images, then click Upload and select File. Browse to and select the Manjaro ISO we just downloaded, then click the Upload button. Once the installation ISO is uploaded to the Proxmox host, we're ready to start creating the VM. Right-click on the Proxmox node name and select Create VM. Give the VM a unique ID and name, then click Next. Select the storage device with the Manjaro ISO, then select it and click Next. Leave the defaults on the System tab, then click Next. Set the storage device for the virtual disk and set the disk size to at least 30 gigabytes, then click Next. Set the number of CPU cores to two or more, and set the CPU type to host, then click Next. Set the memory to 4096 or four gigabytes, then click Next. Leave the defaults on the Network tab, then click Next, and click Finish to create the VM. Select the VM from the left navigation menu, then click the Start button at the top right of the screen. And finally, click Console so we can see the visual output. Press enter at the boot menu to continue booting into the Manjaro live environment. Click the launch installer option on the Welcome to Manjaro dialog window. Select the language, then click Next. Set your region, then click Next. Adjust the keyboard layout, then click Next. Leave the default partition layout, then click Next. Enter a name, username, and computer name. Then set and confirm a password for the regular user and administrative user, then click Next. Review the summary page, then click Install and Install Now to confirm. Wait while Manjaro copies and installs files to the virtual disk. Once the installation completes, click the Done button then shut down the VM. Navigate back to the Proxmox web UI and select Hardware, then double click the CD DVD drive and select Do Not Use Any Media and click OK. Optionally, select Options and double click QMU Guest Agent, then check the box to enable it and click OK. With the settings changed, start the VM and go back to the console. Once you reach a login screen, log in using the username and password you set up during the installation. Once the desktop environment loads, launch a terminal from the taskbar. We'll start by initializing the pacman keyring using the pacman key-init command. Then we'll add the default arch and manjaro keys to the keyring. Then we'll use Pacman to download and install any available updates. Once the update's complete, we'll install the QMU guest agent package. A subsequent reboot is required to start the guest agent. Welcome to Manjaro, running virtualized in a Proxmox VM.